Good first weekend, Coach. Uh, 3-0, and we win the tournament. Talk about the weekend overall. You know, it was a total team effort. A lot of players got playing time. Um, you know, we, we played around with a couple of different things and uh, fought through some adversity. Uh, played really well at the end of sets. Uh, most most of the weekend, which was it was good to see, because there were some pressure points in every match that I felt like we handled really well. I'm really proud of our our offense. You know, hitting over 300 for the weekend was nice, and then I thought serving for us was a strength. Um, you know, it, but playing these three matches allows us the opportunity to see uh, what the things that we need to work on, and we'll get that opportunity when we come back in the gym on Monday to get ready for Tuesday. And, and Coach, talk about, you know, your front line with Thompson and Cliff. You know, he, he was definitely all over the net in all three games. So they were able to control the tempo defensively, which made it to easy uh, text uh, offensively. Sure, sure. You know, Nikita just picked up right where she left off from last season, and uh, she's just, you know, that go-to for us. Um, anytime we need points, uh, she just seems to find a way to get a big kill for us. Um, you know, Catherine Cather had a great weekend for us too. A lot of, a lot of big kills. And then Lexi and Kate on the outside, it just seemed like one or the other one was on all weekend for us. And, um, you know, when, when we played low error and forced the other team to score points, we were really just running away from teams. But when at times we were kind of our own worst enemy. It was when um, I felt like we allowed the teams to, to hang closer than they probably should. And, and Coach, you know, you're close to 500 wins. You know, that, they've been ringing your head a lot, like, hey, each win, I'm getting closer and closer to 500 wins. So this win puts you on the, on the doorstep to 500 wins so, you know, in 18 years of coaching. So talk, talk about, you know, just your whole ride through 18 years and you're, you're closing in on 500 wins. Well, you kind of said it. I mean, it's 19 years. And so uh, there's uh, a lot of people who have been a part of it and a big part of it uh, of this run. And, you know, anytime a coach wins and been blessed to win like I have, it's, it's you've got great players all the way from Lubbock Christian University when I was NAIA to uh, Central Arkansas to Tulsa to here. Um, and I'm just proud to have been their coach. We've got great assistant coaches um, that have done a lot of the work um, to help me get those wins. Um, you know, it's it's one of those things that the, it's just the way sports is. I mean, if you're the head coach, they put the, the win next to your name. They put the loss next to your name, but uh, there's so many people um, that when it does happen uh, that, that I'm going to be thanking because this isn't about me. It's uh, everything that we do in our program, we preach about team. And I'm not the one out there serving the ball and digging it and getting kills and assists and blocks. I mean, we've, we've, that's what the players are doing. And, um, you know, I'm blessed to be here at Ole Miss to do it, to hopefully do it, and hopefully do it Tuesday. Um, you know, and, and, and hopefully this is where I can keep uh, those wins going. And then when I say I, I mean our team. So um, I know it's going to happen, and it's going to be brought up, but really the focus right now is just on getting win number four on Tuesday. Have you 